um, hand. Hello everybody, welcome to Algebra. And we continue uh, with uh, some uh, uh, second degree school, uh, curve. And we are studying uh, A11X2 plus A22Y2 plus 2A12 xy equals to k then we can also write it as lambda 1 epsilon 2 plus lambda 2 eta 2 equals to k then a is a11 a12 a12 a22 is a symmetry uh, matrix and the uh, and the lambda one and two are from this uh, uh, that a minus lambda i equals to zero we have it and we saw also that x y equals to p epsilon eta And uh, it is equals to P11, P12, P21, P22, Epsilon, Eta. And P equals to E, Epsilon, and we saw E, Eta equals to G1, G2. One example is uh, Epsilon 2 divided by A2 plus Eta 2 divided by minus 1. It's impossible. It is positive. It cannot be. But uh, for zero is only in origin uh, in the center epsilon and eta zero and therefore uh, one then we have ellipse 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 It is A and it is A. Okay. Another equation is when uh, this minus is 1, then we have uh, Then we have a, then we have a, and it is a, a and a, two asymptote. And this is B. And this maximum value. Uh, uh, tangents. And this value is B. And for uh, this one. Equals to. Minus one. Then we have a, a two asymptote 
and uh, we have uh, this and this. And this one is B, this A one is B, and this one is A. A and B. And for uh, this equal to zero, then we have two lines. It's only two lines. Epsilon equals to plus minus A divided by B eta. Um, now we are going to have an example. We have an example six x two plus nine y two plus four x y equals to five and a is six two two nine. Because it is this one power two power by two and this two. Then uh, six minus lambda two two nine minus lambda equals to zero give us lambda one ten lambda two five and for lambda then we have uh, 10 epsilon 2 plus 5 eta 2 equals to 5 equals to that 5 then 2 epsilon 2 plus eta 2 equals to 1 and uh, then a equals to one divided by two and b equals to one it is because of that two because of epsilon two divided by a two plus a to 2 divided by b2 and we get this and uh, we are going to have a e epsilon equals to g1 and for g1 g1 is a uh, uh, a G1 equals to lambda G1. Then G1 equals to uh, alpha beta. Then And we are going to take the uh, e g1 then g1 equals to alpha and 2 alpha and uh, g12 which is equals to
epsilon i epsilon 2 i epsilon then absolute i epsilon 2 equals to 1 which is alpha 2 plus 4 alpha 2 equals to 1 then alpha equals to plus minus 1 divided by 5 squared then e epsilon equals to 1 divided by 5 squared 1 2 and for another And uh, this is is the uh, true uh, epsilon axis, and zero is on epsilon axis. Then x minus zero divided by one equals to y minus zero divided by two. Then y equals to two x. And uh, we have a x by it is this is epsilon and perpendicular is eta. And because it is perpendicular, then it is k, then y equals to x minus x divided by 2 for eta. And this is for this. Okay. For We continue with the uh, body in the space in the next uh, video.